Hello guys, how are you doing? It's your boy Dave Partner. Here is a quick tutorial on how to set up Mailer Light uh, API in Laravel. Okay, so there are two to three key links you need to know. The first one is here. Uh, I'm making this tutorial in 2021, uh, which means that the uh, latest API key for API for or API version for Mela Lite is API version 2. So if you look at the top left of your screen, you see that this is I'm using version 2. And to get to version 2, you visit developers.melalite.com slash reference. Um, I don't know why this is difficult to find from Google, but this is it. So on the left side, you will see all the APIs that you need. Okay. So let's go to the setup. Um, First of all, uh, if you go to GitHub, you find this um, repository, and I think it's from official MailerLite. So if you go to uh, github.com slash MailerLite, and then you'll find this API version 2 PHP SDK. All right. So you go uh, and install it, run Composer install. Uh, if you're completely new to Laravel, then this tutorial will not make sense to you. But basically, you open your code. And then run composer install in your cmd so composer require this after that um in my own case i didn't have to run this because it worked perfectly but it said here this library is built on a top psr 7 and psr 18 if you are receiving this particular error discovery failed exception you will need to run this so first of all you run this and then skip this particular portion and try to implement this if you now get this error then you can run this one to upgrade your uh, Gozzle 6 adapter okay so step one run this and uh, if there is no error cool step two we have to test this now this particular setup may not work for you let me show you the code that worked for me in Laravel so I open Laravel there is nothing else I did all right I did not import anything okay there was no importation here and then i just went to a function in my laravel straight up and i ran this code okay uh, this is the code i got exactly from here now you have to replace this with your mailer light api key so to get your mailer light api key you visit mailer light at the top left corner okay let me show you so make sure you are logged into mailer light all right uh, at the top right corner you click this then you go to integrations if you click on this this is where you're going to see your API key inside your mailer light all right so I just clicked uh, integrations uh, if you look at here you can see that you can integrate mailer light into so many things including your Facebook and ad campaign and whatever but what we're trying to do is integrate it into Laravel so you need your developer API key you click here and then you will see it I don't want to click this so that you will not see my API key alright now after seeing it uh, what you're going to do is get back to your Laravel you can insert your API key directly here alright or you put it in your env file I don't want to click my env file so that you will not see everything uh, but if you're a Laravel a programmer you should uh, know how to get this otherwise just copy the api key directly and paste it here you understand you can paste it directly like this so but i would rather put it in my env file so that i can always re reference it from one place so this next line creates a group this is a sample code from the mailer light github account for creating a group here it just makes a call connects to Miller Lite, and then it creates a new group the name of the new group is new group you can call just anything and then it gets you the list of all groups and uh, if you did this you will now see the list of all groups so if I go to my code now look at here I did DD of all groups hope you can see it oh I did a DD of all groups and it shows me list of all groups so here I can say oh this group exists and it has all these details and then this group exists so um, 
on this github page you'll see that this their sample code just creates a group and then you can get a group id and then you can do all sorts of things but these are just five now the mistake they made here is that they did not put the link to the full developer api all right so here i can I remember the first link i showed you initially from miller Lite. so this is where you get the code for every other thing you want to do in miller Lite. the one we just use for groups is here you see subscriber groups you understand this is the one we just used so if you read this whole thing about groups you will see how to use them and the sample data that it returns so if you take your time you can start seeing uh, ways to implement this api key or this uh, miller light api all right and uh, it's just a regular api but setting it up in laravel is what's important now here are some mistakes i made initially i tried to import it in app.php so i went to app.php and tried to list it here as alias it did not work it threw a weird kind of error and i did that to import it in providers it did not work so don't just do anything on this file another thing is that i tried to import it at the top of the page here it did not work so don't try to import it just go straight to your code and start writing code all right thank you very much guys see you